Off camera, I actually ended up cutting a lot more. Yeah, a lot of hairs. I cut a lot of hair. I just trimmed it all in one length. As you can see, it's quite long. And it's been getting tangly, so I'm gonna cut it. Give it a nice cut. If I, if I cut all my hair off, I do believe that Tommy would not be happy. My mom would cry. She's done that before. She had a good reason. I went from long hair to a pixie cut. It was pretty dramatic. She asked me later, why Why did you cut all your hair off? I was like, because I could. <laughs> I wanted to see what it was like just one time. I'm, not, I'm never gonna cut it like that again. I like it long, but it needs a little bit of a trim. So I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna section it off into two areas. <laughs> Theodore has a little top. Let's see. And I just washed and did a rough dry of my hair. So, thankfully my hair, when it, um, when I use a blow dryer on it, it dries really straight. It's naturally very wavy, but it straightens out super easily. Here. My hair is so long, I don't know if I'm going to be able to capture this on film. take this short section. I got this is a nice look. <laughs> I got a line coming up from behind my ear on both sides. I have these nice lovely um, baby hairs coming in. Well they're they've already come in. They have they're growing out uh, postpartum hair loss. I like to say that it's actually because the baby pulls your hair out versus your hormones changing. I feel like Theodore has pulled more hair out of my head than because of my hormones changing. Okay, so now I'm going to take a ponytail holder and do this. I'm going to double check all of these before I do any cutting. <laughs> this is a nice look. <laughs> okay, so now I'm going to take the back and get it to go up. I'm going to flip my head over for this one. Another ponytail holder. This is the look that I have going on right now. Let's see what Tommy thinks. Hey, Tommy. Come here for a second. What do you think of this hair, dude? Mm -hmm. 
Sound backwards day. I'm backwards day. It's not an actual hairdo. I'm gonna trim my hair. Oh, you are. Mm-hmm. Okay, now I'm gonna take this one. Reach as high as I can. So our bathroom isn't finished. So my sinks and everything are sitting on the floor in my bedroom. So this is gonna be my hair collector, my KitchenAid mixing bowl. <laughs> I'm gonna use it to collect my hair when I cut it. Okay, so I'm gonna take my hair and I'm gonna pull it all the way to the end to cut it. Another way is to put a ponytail holder on. Now I like to make sure this one's tight. So take and slide it down. Keeping the hair straight. And as the further down you get, to tighten the ponytail holder some more. So it keeps your hair like this, cause there's, there is no way, cause my hair is just too long. There's no way for me to hold my arms all the way up here and cut my hair. So I gotta bring it down here. So the actual bottom layers of my hair have already fallen out of the ponytail holder. Cause I'm not, I'm not gonna cut all the way down in there. So. I'm going to take and trim this. I'm going to start out small. Take it and turn it a little bit. Because cutting a big chunk like this at one time, you're more likely to get an, a very uneven cut. So, trying to make sure I get all my hair in the bowl. Like the perfect blush brush. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to do the same thing to this one. I'm not going to use a ponytail holder for this one. I'm just gonna bring it up, just straight up, slide my hand up it till I get to the end right here. So all the hairs are going in the same direction. And I'm going to trim it up. Okay. Now, the amount that I took off is not, I don't think I'm going to actually even see the difference. This is the amount of hair that I cut. So I might end up taking off more. We'll see. Take these down. My brush already goes through it a lot easier. But doing what I just did didn't take any length off of the actual whole entirety of my hair. Now it took length off up in here. You can see that this is shorter than this is. Okay, now, this right here is 
a tricky part. The way I trim the actual length of my hair, I take and pull all my hair back to as hard as I can to get it back right here. And I do another one. I'm gonna pull it straight down the hair to keep my hair going in the same direction. Okay. Now I can pull it around and trim straight across. Turn my scissors around. <laughs> Y'all are having fun in there. Singing me some good music. So that was the easy, like, just straight up trim. This is the mount that I took off just now. <laughs> so that is haircut of the day. <laughs> off camera, I actually ended up cutting a lot more. Yeah, that's a lot of hair. I cut a lot of hair. The after, or the reveal. <laughs>it's raining even more now uh, I was hoping that it would be sunny for all this but nope. it's gonna be rainy all week so this is all I'm doing I had this plan of doing all sorts of fun like braided hairstyles and stuff because I love doing all that kind of stuff um, but yeah I'm gonna leave it at that because I am getting pretty wet at least it's warm out here. It's been pretty cold. I think we had our coldest snap the past several days, but it's warmed back up, thankfully. With that, I am going to say goodbye. I hope and I pray that you all have a blessed day. This has been April Dawn with love. Some hey, look, see, that's not so bad. Hey, let me see you. Oh, you can see better, huh? Maybe turn him this way a little bit. Your hair's not in your eyeballs. <gasps> look at that haircut. <laughs> <laughs> there, you oh. That looks better. Okay, now go play. Oh, oh. <laughs>